LW is gonna tell a story about the time he got scurvy. Oh, good. Yeah, so... You're gonna tell it while we were taking Sorry, just to like reiterate, to <laughs> a man in the 2000s <laughs> is going to tell us how he got scurvy. Yeah, I got scurvy in like a 2000. A pirate disease. Yeah, like <laughs> it, it, it's very close to uh, jaundice, too, because my, uh, my skin was starting to go orange. Jesus Christ. Yeah, dude, it was great. Uh, like 2007, actually. <laughs> <laughs> A good year. Good year. Good year. Uh, Bush's second term. Yeah. No, Bush's second are term. Going well. It was. I. I Victory did, in uh, Iraq. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'll, I'll you're, good. you're good. You're good. You're <laughs> good. Uh, I ended up going into a uh, furry flop house, which is great when you're like fresh twenty one. What is a furry flop house? I uh, every furry house I've ever been in. Oh. Almost. <laughs> Fairy Flop House is, is pretty much the equivalent of, uh, oh wow, you, you safe state? <laughs> a bunch of broke-ass, borderline, so broke ass borderline homeless furries. <laughs> right. So we had eight people in an apartment that, yeah. that cost like $1,200 a month. Cool. Right. And uh, we were like, oh god, how are we going to make money? Because, I mean, no one worked. It was like eight people in an apartment. Why would we work? Well, working's for suckers. It's for so. suckers. So we were like, dude, this is how we do it. We just, you know, live off of ramen. And it's a 14 cents a pack, right? So, I mean, we just go to the gas station and beg for fucking 14 cents. We just look at somebody <laughs> and go, hey, man, I need a quarter to live. And, they, like, you just stare them down. Until oh, that's we, funny. Right. You just stare them down. It, 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 it worked most of the time. And so we just went to Kroger and got some, some ramen. My dumbass didn't understand that ramen is probably more expensive than just an orange. <laughs> <laughs> it could have saved my life, but whatever. And, uh... We ended up just eating ramen for three months, and I started noticing scabs in the back of my head. And I was like, man, this is really not normal. And we ran out of money, too, so I was like, oh shit, what do we do? And my buddy's like, hey, we got like 80 bucks left, right? And I'm like, yeah, we got like 80 bucks left. He's like, okay, we're gonna go to New Orleans. I'm like, oh, all right. So we only had enough money for gas to get to New Orleans. We went to New Orleans to go, for me to go play on the street, because I play music and shit like that, and busk. I was able to make $20. <laughs> And found out that the YMCA does not allow you in if you're over 18. Hmm. Yeah. Really good tidbit of knowledge for you uh, drifters out there. A very young man. Sorry, what? Uh, YMCA in America does not allow you to come and sleep in there if you're over 18. Oh. Yeah. Uh, oh, found... I didn't even realize they let people sleep in there. Oh, yeah. Place. They do. If you're under 18, you can go and sleep in the YMCA's if yeah. you can find them nowadays. I don't even know if they're still around. Like, it's this is good way back. for gay people. I've been told <laughs> it's fun to stay at the YMCA. I've been told. I've Just been told. To, but they're very, they're very scrupulous. They're ageist. Wow, what a story, LW. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was great. You really bringing back the pirate's life. It was it was, it was good. Like, uh, I got scouts, scouts in the back of my head, and then uh, we didn't eat for, like, two days, and we were able to find, like, this bunch of bros that were just walking around New Orleans, and I had, like, a bunch of shitty-ass weed. And I was like, hey, guys, like, what? I'm like, you guys want weed, right? Like, oh, you got weed? I'm like, yeah, man. I got, like, some beasters. I got some, like, awesome heady shit. And it's, like, seedy and stemmy as fuck. And I was like, yeah, I did, like, 60 bucks for a gram. I'm like, oh, cool. And I was like, here you go, bro. And grabbed that shit, got the fuck out of New Orleans. Oh, my God. We went to a Taco Bell immediately, and I got a bean burrito and, like, never looked back. <laughs> Did, and did you eventually, like, eat a fucking orange and uh, save your life? <laughs> I eventually did eat a fucking orange, and, uh, but it was when my skin was starting to turn orange, too. <laughs> so, mm. I, I, it was bad. Like, I, I just went to sleep for, like, three days after eating, uh, like, chicken noodle soup, I think, was what I had <laughs> for the first time. That was, like, something more substan wow. substantial. You are a pirate! Hey, guys. Thanks for watching my videos. I need to give a special shout out to my $5 patrons, Tequila Cinema and Pit Wang, and uh, have a happy holidays.